we go. Testing, testing. One, two. Everybody, welcome. You're tuned in to the main event, the brand new podcast we're doing live out of Las Vegas. Uh, you know, we bring the best to everybody that come here to talk to us about the sport. We're bringing you the rumors, the real side, the not-so-true side, and everything everybody afraid to ask. We asking it all right here. We don't care here on the main event. My name is Tawan Butler. Make sure y'all like and subscribe on YouTube, the main event podcast. We're doing big things. It's going to be everybody check it out, for real, for real. To my right, right here, we got Thomas Hill, up and coming fighter. He'll lay you out still. He climbing his way to the top. And now I'm going to let him tell you, Thomas, what's happening, man? You good? Yeah, we all good, man. Just working, waiting on the next one. You know, got a lot of things tied up. Just, you know, maintain it till we get another fight. Oh, yeah, for sure, man. The brother signed with Al Hammond, too, so he making moves. You know, he going to do what he do. Be on the lookout for him. To my other, other left, we got Mike Risper, <laughs> my man over there. Knowledgeable on the sport. They've been around the sport for a long time, been my partner for about 10 to 12 years, and we always talking boxing in the barbershop. Mike, what's going on, man? How you doing? Oh, man, I'm doing good, man. You doing, doing good? real good. Yep. Man, welcome, welcome. This is the second episode, but it won't be the last episode. We doing things right here, right on the main event. And to my immediate left. I just knew you was going to say it. Blessed. <laughs> blessed, my brother. Blessed. blessed to my, my immediate brother. left. Hold on, let me get the intro right. I was ready. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> to my brother. immediate left, I really got a man that needs no introduction, but I'm going to give you a little bit of bottom. The man had been in so many movies. If we did it right here, we'd be here all night. But, but just you can't the, play my movies in here. Oh, we can play them. They, they, they play them on BET. They play them on BET. They be editing. You hear the, the, the DJ scratches on hey, BET. get your butt away from here. Yeah, there it is. There it is. My man right here. You done seen him in Three Strikes. You done seen him in Money Talks. You Roof. done seen him in Out of Wild. You done seen him in Couples Star Retreat. Star Wars. You done seen him in, what you say? Star Wars. He said Star Wars. I was space in Star Wars. But I'm not, I might be telling my age, right? I might be telling my age. But when I first seen the brother on the big screen, I was about 15, 16 years old. His name was Big Worm. And when he told Smokey he was going to kill him and Craig if they didn't get his money, I was going to help Smokey and Craig find the money. I was scared for him. You feel me? So to my immediate left, none other than the big homie himself, Faye Zahn Love. Make some home, make some noise Thank for the homie Faye Zahn Love in the building, everybody. That was such a warm welcoming. I mean, you know, you got a lot of stuff, brother. You know, we. No, no, I got you. <laughs> nah, we thank you coming down, man. For real, for real. This brother right here, man, came into the barbershop. If y'all don't know, the barbershop is called the Barber Company. 7320 South Rainbow, <laughs> Suite 111, if you need the freshest fade in Vegas. Oh, yeah. But. The man came into the barbershop. We met him. He was he was a real one. He came in. You know, he was being himself, as we see on TV for many years. And, and we just clicked with him. You know what I'm saying? Then we found out he was a, a big fan of boxing. And what better way to bring the big homie down to talk about the biggest fights in boxing and some upcoming big fights in boxing? You know, what better to bring him down to come holler at us? Faze on, man. I appreciate it, bro. How I you doing? I appreciate you here. Um, Hill over here looks like he wants a piece of Mr. Sean Porter, but. <laughs> uh, I don't you think know. you can handle that real estate? Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Yeah, uh -oh. I've I, I been in the ring with Sean. But, I've been in the ring with a lot of those guys. I, I, I'm not I, talking about putting an autograph to get in the ring. <laughs> no, I ain't no fan. I'm a fighter. <laughs> well, tell him. Well, was, tell you, was you um, um, sparring him? Yeah, I sparred him a few times. Right. I got to spar Sean a lot of times. What was that work like when you were sparring Sean? Compare, what was that work compare like? from him and Spence? No, no, yeah. no, no, no. Oh, uh, well, no, how no. was that work just sparring Sean? Yeah, yeah. Sean is in work? high energy. If I keep the pace with him, I do great. And I do keep the pace with him because I don't get tired either. I don't get tired. <laughs> do you get hurt? <laughs> you get hurt. Hey, you get I'm human. <laughs> <laughs> what a, what he ain't never hurt me. He ain't never hurt me. Or He's nice. Thomas, what happened if you don't keep the pace? If you don't get to the pace, then he going to run over you. He going to outwork you. Now, when you say run over you, do you mean like lump, lump, and dump? <laughs> <laughs> now, do you go nah. home like this? <laughs> with, the, with the rocky nah. shades? Uh, nah, man. Look, I knew, Sean, I knew Sean for a while, man. I knew Sean since I was... 11, 12 man, years old. talking about Listen, I, I, ain't, I ain't saying that either. <laughs> okay. But what I'm saying is he been he always been an aggressive fighter, high energy, strong, and he's aggressive. So if you keep that pace and bang with him and box at the same time like he tries to do, you'll hold your own. Yeah. But if you sit there and you wait for him, he going he gonna to run over you. He going to take over. 
He going to take control of the whole match. He going to run you over. Why y'all like this guy spent so much? Huh? Man, Spencer. Hold on, Mike. He the truth. Like you was about to take off on somebody, no. Mike. He, when he, he said, the truth. I, Mike like Earl truth. Smith. He, what? I, he Mike the like truth. Earl Smith. Mike was gonna come across this table. You ain't even. Yeah, yeah. See that right now? I'm gonna say I, I like Spence. <laughs> you like Porter, right? Uh, I just know. Go ahead. Go ahead. Well, I, I like Spence because of his style of fight. You know, he come to fight. He's, he's a warrior. Uh-huh. You know, when he went across the pond over there. He took all every. He took his greatest punch and kept coming. Now, what do you think he gonna do to Porter when he get in the ring with Porter? Exactly. He gonna keep Porter gonna come with his best punch. What Porter gonna, gonna do eat, when he get he hit by eat Spence? That punch and keep coming. The guy is relentless. So you guys haven't been watching boxing. Yeah. What, what what Porter gonna do when he okay. get hit by Spence? Let me play something to you. Now, boxing let, now. Let me hear him. Boxing now, when it comes to your your size, ain't about the punch. Mm-hmm. It's about what? Talk to me. Sticking and moving. Okay. Mm-hmm. You're right. Sticking and moving. Okay. Now, who's well, the greatest at that? Floyd. Thank you. But he never. What? Go ahead. Hold on. Let me let me take over uh, this. Sean Porter can't even do that. What? When he did that with your Dennis Ugas, he really lost. Look, and, and I was <laughs> just going to say. <laughs> who got the win? I was you right. Gonna, okay. Sometimes right. the powers be where they be. Sometimes the powers <laughs> why be where they be. Why you saw Adrian? Why you saw Adrian Burner? He really know. I really won. Look, look, look. Sometimes the coin flip out of coin flip. We can't, we can't do that. You know, you flip it, it land how it land. But yeah. that's not even Sean Porter fighting style. Yeah, Sean, Sean to me, gotta be Sean, Sean Porter. You got to put Sean Porter in a phone booth in a fight, and then he's gonna be the best in the phone booth. Can I tell you something? Tell me everything. Karate here. Karate <laughs> not here. <laughs> right, there. I, right. I, I, I dig it. I dig it. But you put him in the phone booth. I bet on him almost every time. Because that's when you his got fight. The that's his circle fight. To yeah. Move around, that's, that's and you got real do. estate listen to move. To I don't know. Uh, listen to me. Okay. He's strategic. So y'all don't like him because he ain't show business. That's he's the one. I do like Sean. Yeah. He's, 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 he's in the show but he was a world now. champion. I know. He is, yeah. You give credit when credit is due, but I'm yes, just sir. saying he's not on Smith's level. I buy both of those Don't guys. Don't get me wrong. We he's like we like we like Porter. Porter is a true champion. Yes. But, but the thing about Porter is Porter versus Spence. Spence, he know how to get in the ring and he can stick to the plan or he can change the plan. See, the, Porter I'm, cannot do that. I'm glad you said that. Porter gonna stay on the same plan. I'm glad you said that. From speed. day one, from from round one to round twelve. You know you fucked up. He he he's not gonna <laughs> change. Oh, he's not gonna change. He's not gonna change. He's gonna, change. He gonna do you know the same. You up, right? He's gonna do the same thing the whole fight. Exactly. You know what Mike Tyson said? Tell me what he said. Everybody got a plan. Until, until they, they get, get hit. hit. Until they get hit. But Sean, the only one talking about he got the plan, right? No. Come on, man. <laughs> Come on, man. He's the he's the only one that out of all the people that fight on that basically say he got the answer to beat this guy. Yeah, he does. I what what is that? Please that? please enlighten me. I please enlighten me on I what I've been in the ring with both of those guys, and I can tell you who got better attributes and who better at whatever. But he can't show you everything. Facts, a hundred percent. He can't show me everything. He can only work on his. He can only when he's a boxer sparred. No, nah, yeah, you working he, on whatever you working on to enhance he's that. He's working on the game. Correct. Play. They, no, you working on your weaknesses. Not all the time. I'm, I'm I, telling not, you. Not not with you, him. Not all the time. And if, I can I can say that because I've been in the ring with him and his father. Tell me how many. And, tell him how many people you knocked out. <laughs> Tell him how many, yeah, how many, how many people, people you got knocked, knocked out? out? Forget Literally. all this. How many people you knocked out? If I was a boxer, <laughs> I would do. I would play my shit totally different than y'all. How would you do it? How would you? Do I it? would do every interview like I'm scared. Everyone. Everyone. Well, why is that? Is that, to, is that to make the opponent like? <laughs> look, look, he's trying to make himself scared right now. Give us an example. Give us an example. Like me and you gonna fight, right? Right, right. And I would be like, can I sit over there? I, you real timid, real <laughs> timid behind him. I'll be like, I, I don't know. I, I'm gonna have to cancel this fight because I respect him so much, and you can't hit him. And I, I, I just don't know. I think I'm overwhelmed. <laughs> <laughs> now, as soon what, as we get that wing, your mind is thinking something different. What? Well, tell him what his mind right. thinking. Man, I'm, a, I'm a, I, ain't got, I ain't even got to run. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't got to do the jump rope. No. Nah. So what you're saying is you can eat a large pizza and still put paws on it. Basically. Me, I'm 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 running uphill seven thousand 
Woo, I'm li- I'm doing a Rocky run. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm tricking him to thinking that I'm you ain't going to be ready. <laughs> right? Right, right, when right. We get in that ring. Shabba! <laughs> He's going down. And what round, though? What round are you going to put him down? I don't there? know. Do every, every round is. Because remember, you said it's here. So what round are you going to drop him in? No, no. I'm just saying. I don't he know what round I'm going to He just giving you the strategy. Oh, okay. That's well, what I he would do. Know. I want to know. He just giving you the my, strategy. My, that's my strategy. If, if, that everybody can whoop my ass in real life. I never look at a man and be like, I can whoop his ass. I don't care how big he is, how small he is, how many. Everybody can whoop my Everybody in this room can whoop my ass. Everybody can whoop somebody. I got to prove to myself, no, he can't. I agree with you. I agree. I agree with you. For I real. agree. So that's how totally. that's how I like. Okay. So it's safe to say in the yeah. Sean Porter Earl Spence fight, you definitely putting all your money on Sean Porter. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me ask you. I just want where to you know, from? It, it sounds like that's who he was. Where you from, Faison? The, the Earth is my turf. <laughs> the earth is my turf. <laughs> no, Lego, New York. I'm no. Turf. Where were you born? <laughs> <laughs> Please tell me. Where were you born? You sound like you know. Uh, yeah, Trump, I sound like you Trump know. is putting people back. With <laughs> <laughs> bad, um, oh, with bad uh, birth certificates. So. Bad birth certificates. <laughs> where, so. where were you born? What city? In the hospital. What In city? I, oh, uh, Newark. <laughs> no, you Newark. weren't. Man. That, that, that ain't got nothing to do Man. with who we gonna put his money yes, on it does, September twenty eighth. <laughs> oh, oh, is that why? Yes, yes. Cleveland. Yes. No, I love Cleveland. I'm, I used to, I used to live in Cleveland. I That's to, why. Columbus. Okay. I love all them places. Cleveland, Columbus. So, so it's safe there. to say you're a little biased. That's all. Oh, no. <laughs> no, 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 no. I don't think no. he's biased. He just no. like who he like. No, you know? that's he, real. He that's real. What's what? the fight that we bought bet on? You still owe me a dinner from? Yeah, I do. Yeah, the... I've been telling you. Let, I was well, let's you let's make a bet. Let's make a bet on like this that. fight. What's... I got Spence uh, and you got Sean. There we go. You owe me a dinner if you win, yeah. and I owe oh, you. Wait a minute, hold on, hold on, because then we we doubled up on this. Yes, we did. We bet double and nothing. Yes, we did. Right or wrong? We right or wrong at the barbershop. Yes, we did. Seventy three twenty South Rainbow. <laughs> Everybody come down, get the haircut. The best barbershop in Las Vegas. Come down, I promise you, he wouldn't be there if we wasn't fired for sure. But we did bet. Yes, we did. We doubled up. Yes, we did. So basically. I ain't going to have to feed you then. We will you know, see. I'm, Sean Porter a good dude. I know him. Right, I know his right. daddy. You said know, this yeah. the first time. Right. You was so adamant about, about Spence. Spence. What was no. the first fight, no. though? Well, yeah, what oh, was the no, first Pacquiao fight Thurman. Thurman. Pacquiao Thurman. And Pacquiao you had Thurman. Thurman? I did. What type I did. of you had Pacquiao? I did. Well, you I did say what? I, I told did. you that at the barbershop not to bet on him. <laughs> I did. But, you know, I mean, Pacquiao, he been around forever. You know what I'm saying? He done whooped some of the best ball. of the best. The only yeah. person he couldn't yeah. whoop was, you know, who. That was really a trap fight, though. He took that too soon. He just came back. No, it ain't he no. He take never, that. He, he never fought. Took he that fought fight. the best Hosecito of the best. Lopez. He, he should have never took that fight. He hit him with something that uh, you know, turn that ringer off. Who we live? Who live over there? He oh, fought the best man. of the best. Oh, that wasn't no trap <laughs> fight. He just got exposed that he can't fight Can South Park. No, no, it was a trap fight. Say That's something. Karate here. Karate no here. Okay. <laughs> okay. So what you saying is Earl Spence ain't got it here. Right. Now what about his career? Make you think he ain't got it here? You think Porter got it there? Look at Look at his career. Sure. It ain't, his career ain't like that. What do you mean? Okay. All right. He like he go back to the 70s. Let's, let's talk Wait about a, his career. The one dude he went to go embarrass beat your boy, Shell yeah, Brooks. beat the Kale hell out Brooks. your boy. Knocked the I, I Kale Brooks out. gave Sean Porter a boxing lesson. Earl Spence went over there and put paws on him in his house. And broke his eye bone. Come on, man. The boy, and the stopped me. The man took a knee. <laughs> Come on, the man. The man quit. Have you guys ever heard of Mike Tyson? The man quit. Have you guys ever heard of Mike Tyson? <laughs> yeah. Yes, sir. There's a guy in Columbus that beat Mike Tyson. Who is that? And ain't beat nobody since. Buster? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Buster Douglas, what's happening? You, I, I, you, I seen uh, it. Uh, it's a different type of situation. No, it's not. A broken yeah. clock going to be right twice a day. But Mike was going through a lot, though, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Anybody. Buster Douglas, a mama a, had a just what? passed a away. What? Buster Douglas, mama had just passed away. Mike was going through the stuff with Don King. He thought his money was being robbed from him. He was over there in Japan. He was doing everything before the fight you shouldn't do. Can I tell you? Can I tell you no? Okay. I was in South Africa. Okay. Mm-hmm. Le- uh, Lennox Lewis is fighting. Lennox and me talking. He's like, I'm doing a movie in Las Vegas. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Okay. <laughs> Nigga, you know you about to fight, right? You know you about to fight. Yeah, except doing the movie. We're doing a movie called, uh, I forgot the movie called. Ocean's Eleven. Ocean's Eleven. Yeah, you see, I know. I'm a Vegas veteran. Okay. <laughs> we go to the fight. I'm like, this will be an easy fight. I'm right. Right. This is South Africa. This is. Guy named was what? Rashawn? Who? Oh, they was fighting in the movie? No. They're fighting in South Africa. Oh, no. I don't know. Oh, y'all remember, South remember that? South huh? Africa. See, y'all don't remember history. Y'all don't remember <laughs> history. Who did Lennox Lewis fight in South Africa? Rashawn. Rashawn who? You know how many black people named Rashawn? Oh, <laughs> oh, you don't know history. No, no. You must I don't know, know names. <laughs> <laughs> His name was Rashad. Rashad. Okay. Rashad what? What year? Take me to the year, Rashad man. Lewis. Did you make that up? No. Oh, see. <laughs> basketball. Okay. The what fact that I don't basketball. know this. Tell, tell us what happened. Tell us what, what happened. What happened was Rashad laid Lewis out. So what does that have to do in with this South situation? Africa. Okay. I'm going to have to go to YouTube. I don't, <laughs> I don't know nobody. We're going to have to pull up box for the Everybody look at uh, right? Look at South Africa. Lennox Lewis. Amateur fight? Olympics? Yeah, no. Olympic? I don't remember. This <laughs> at the peak. This at the peak of Lewis's career. He was the best. He had beat everybody. The homie pulling it up right now. That's the best thing about Google. We can settle this right now. Rashad what? Ramen. Okay. Ramen has him. What was his record? So is that is, does that to correct you when you say even a garbage can get a steak? Even I, a broken clock yeah, is right that's twice what I'm a day. I tell you, you guys. Okay. I'm telling you, y'all, y'all putting so, too much. So okay. You, you, okay. So this is what's gonna happen mm -hmm. with Porter. So Porter and clock Spence. gonna be right, and Spence ain't gonna know how to this, tell time. Basically, this story <laughs> all represent how you feel about Porter and Spence, right? Yes. Okay. I, I like steakhouses. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now, now, <laughs> I like a Popeye's chicken sandwich. <laughs> a sandwich? Oh, hold on, they ain't pay us to promote the sandwich now. Hold on, we can't just be promoting the sandwich. And you can get hold one. Hold on now, hold on, Popeye's. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> Edit that out. They ain't pay us yet. They ain't pay us yet. No. Okay, so but but it is safe to say you is gonna drop your bread on on Sean Porter. Basically, that's that's who you riding with all day long. I can dig it. I can dig. Okay, I, I mean, man, you, you go going ahead, to the fight, right? Yes, I am. I'll be there. Take me dinner in L.A. What you? Yes. Do? <laughs> <laughs> I like Nobu. I like no. Me too. I <laughs> okay. gotta do what y'all gotta do. Uh, what was you about to say, Mike? I'm sorry, brother. Rematch. Eddie, Murphy. Andy, uh, Andy Ruiz. And the big boy. Anthony Joshua. Anthony Joshua. I think you said it wrong. Got. <laughs> it, it don't matter. You the know big, what I'm talking about. The big boy, Andy Ruiz. <laughs> Anthony yeah. Josh. And no, Anthony Joshua. Joshua the big boy. I, that's what I was yeah, saying. you know what I mean. Nah. <laughs> I didn't mean it. Like, that's not what I was saying. <laughs> nah, it's all good. We talking about who you got, basically. Did you see the first fight? And what did you think of the first fight? That's when you beat him through the thing. No, we talking about the uh, the big Mexican, Andy Ruiz. Remember, he was overweight. Everybody was and laughing. He knocked, knocked him out. And uh, yeah. was going in there dogging that boy. And homeboy had uh, rips. Oh, he was there. Yeah. Swimsuit model. That, that's my mo That's <laughs> a <Motivation>. broken clock. <laughs> 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 so you got Andy again? You think Andy going to do it again? I got, I got Andy, Andy, Andy on. I got Andy. I got Andy. Andy. I got Andy. What, was wrong, what was wrong with him the first time? Nothing. Nothing. Everybody <laughs> was under that. But I knew Andy wasn't no punk. I met Andy a few years ago. He was friends with a fighter. I was helping out in the game. First of all, let but me tell you something. Everybody going to tell you, the Mexican fighter is the hardest fight to win. Yeah, because they, they come to fight. That's true. They come to fight. They, they do come to fight. They're not just fighting for no car. Nah. They, they got fight people. for the city. <laughs> they fight for everybody. The country. Everybody. Lupe. Straight up. So, they <laughs> tough. So, so you riding with Andy Ruiz on the rematch, Man, hands down. Y'all don't remember Roberto Duran? You know I remember Roberto Duran. No, but you don't remember sure. Rockman. I seen, yeah, I seen Rockman. I seen yeah. Rockman. Now he dropped Lennox Lewis. Sure did. That's Maybe. what I'm talking about. Oh yeah. man, you said Rashawn. Something like that. <laughs> yeah, everybody know I seen Rockman knock Lewis out in South Africa. I was there. It was in South Africa? Yeah. Oh, okay. I, I don't know, know where he was, was but Africa. I know he got his butt whooped. It was in South Africa. Where they had a rematch at? Uh, I think it was D.C. or something. Who won the rematch? You know who won the rematch. Because <laughs> that clock only worked once when it's broke. Oh, well, all you got to do is work once. <laughs> once could change your life. I remember after the fight, 
Lennox was talking to me, and I was like, this is like, yes, I'm, I'm working on my acting chops. I was like, you better work on some ducking. You need to work on ducking. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody knew yeah. he was going to. He had a big Haseen Rockman. Yeah. Haseen Rock, I apologize. We trying to get him on the show, too. I reached out. He already confirmed he was going to come through and everything. Yeah, I, I was there. He was there. But, man, I'm sorry we ain't know. He said the wrong name, Haseen. He said no, 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 Rashawn. No, no, no. Haseen don't I sound nothing like Rashawn. Yeah, we, we didn't know what was going on. We didn't, we didn't know. know. We didn't know. Hold up, hold up. We I thought said, it was a fight. We didn't know I about I said South Africa, Lennox Lewis getting knocked out. That's enough. That's like you saying, <laughs> Africa, rope a dope. <laughs> Okay. Muhammad Ali. Uh, Muhammad Ali. Okay. It was. Okay. Okay. Our right. bad. Here at Our Main bad. Event. Our you bad. That. Everybody like and subscribe to the Main Event Podcast on YouTube. But we're, 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 where we say our bad when we're wrong. Who would you say is the greatest fighter of all time? Floyd. Who Tell me why not. Who, who Tell me why great? not. Why who's you your hitting the table? Who's your greatest? Y'all goldfish. Tell me why not. I said the greatest fighter of all time. Who is that in your eyes? Are you crazy? They got, they got a good explanation People why they know. picked them. I mean, I debated with them at the I bet you if we it. all put $20 right here, after I explain to you, I'm going I'm to get it. Well, after I explain it to them, I'm going to get it too. So we both good at explaining what we like. You want to explain to me why Floyd is the best? I can tell you mm-hmm. why you don't think he's the best. No, 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 no. Floyd is. Any statistical category you put him you in. You must be crazy. Any statistical must be category crazy. you put him you in, must be crazy. he leads it. You, I said of Any all statistical times. of all time. We talking about most punches landed, less getting hit in the sport, That's most, the most money Floyd made, come to his most job. pay-per-view <laughs> buys, most, I mean, the list goes on Make and on. Most, on. He beat more world champions than that any world champion. Zero I mean, losses. Except, except zero one. losses. Except for who? Jack Johnson, nigga. Jack, so he I the best? There. That's who you got? That's who you Jack got. Jack Johnson? That's who you got? He was beating up white folks in front of white folks. You know what they was doing? They was grabbing him out the bar. No. Jack Johnson, rest you in peace. Must be he, crazy. Is, he is a legend you in the must sport. Be out I'm not your taking mind. nothing you away from Jack, Jack Johnson. Johnson is I'm the not the taking best nothing away from Jack Johnson. In the world. Nothing at all. Nothing. nothing. But back but in them days. When they were fighting barehanded. Brother, we still talking about Jack Johnson? Johnson? Right. <laughs> they were fighting barehanded. That's like saying, uh, I'm seven feet and I could dunk on anybody six feet. No, brother. Come on, man. No, you don't understand. He was fighting Come. white men in front of white. Do you understand? You couldn't and drink water in front of white people. He was knocking them out. He didn't he have was, to drink nothing. And then he got a white woman. He was a player. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Do you understand me? He's the greatest to do it of He's all time. time. But 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 when you gonna call that white women? I mean, you seen Floyd on all the uh, no, no, all no, 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 no. But he ain't doing it while they the lynching black people. Uh, okay. oh, so that's so, yeah, so that's yeah, outside the ring. Right. To get so so we judging outside the ring. I guess that's what. Oh, oh, okay. All right. You tell me. Now you now you tell me. Outside. Hey, the ring. Outside the we're ring. We talking about outside the ring. You you telling me what happens outside the ring? Don't affect inside the ring. No, I mean, it's two totally yeah, different worlds. Two, two different worlds. What world. you mean as when far as like... When you get in like, the ring, it's about you beating your opponent. First of all, son, you have to you, get to the ring. That's right. Okay. Jack Johnson it, it was a black you man mentally in the physically. 1900s. Correct. When people were slaves. <laughs> knocking white folks out. And that was the internet. And hopping... Point. No. But y'all not getting what he's trying to say. Thank it does you. affect you on the inside of the ring because things that goes on outside the ring could affect you mentally and physically and per- have Thank you me. perform at a poor level versus okay. just being relaxed and being at your top tier all the time. All they had to do is go to We the got team. that. Oh, no, no. We got that. That's listen, what he just though. But listen, but listen the, the point we're making mm. is mm-hmm. when you're talking about the greatest, you got to talk about the effect that you had in the ring. That's there you, would not well, be a Floyd that's, that's if there what was you not a Jack Johnson. We, judging, I, we agree. We're judging we agree. on what did you do in the ring? How did you win your fights? What angles did you take? Did you get knocked out? Floyd did you give a knockout? You. All those things. If you ask Floyd in right the now, ring. who's now, the greatest of now, all time, he's going to say Jack Johnson. No. No. He's, he's going to say Floyd. <laughs> he really going to tell you him. He's going to say I'm the greatest. He's going to tell you him. And he's not lying. So over – now – over Muhammad, 
I personally I, I, do. Yeah. I would. I personally now, now, do. I, I, I like my. I'd knock against Ali. I, love, I like yeah. Ali. We I had like Ali. Ali best friend here Vegas. last week. Nah, so I we like ain't Ali. taking nothing away we from Ali. We in Vegas. We are in Vegas. Yeah, we are in Vegas. But, but I like Floyd Ali. Floyd must have brought all y'all niggas in there. No, no, no. sir. Because there's no, no way you're going to no, say sir. Floyd over Muhammad Ali. Yeah, I said when we break it down statistically. Th- that's what we're talking about. I'm talking about the statistics of the sport. It's basically like Drake. saying who scored more points, Kobe Drake. or LeBron. So if Kobe scored more points than LeBron, statistically, who was the better player? Listen to me. There's no way in the world. You can't say nothing about nobody in Cleveland, just to let you know. I'm sorry. Yeah, well, first yeah, of all, that's Cleveland. bad reference. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. First I'm of sorry. all, first of all, <laughs> Muhammad Ali quit boxing, was forced out. For, yeah, he was. Because he didn't ha- go to a war that he didn't start. Yeah. Okay. Politically, he was the first Kaepernick without a right. Jay-Z. Again, we're Coming saying what he did. I- I'm talking Come about on. Floyd Mayweather, in Pretty Boy, Money ring. Mayweather in the ring. I'm not judging what he I done guarantee you, if, if, if anybody see this the podcast, ring. they're going to say, y'all been smoking that. Oh, wait. <laughs> yes. But. <laughs> and I'm not but, saying, but. I'm not taking nothing away from Floyd. You but can't. when you say the greatest, hey, that's where I go. Hey, the I greatest. Ain't comment on who the I mean, greatest. But you know how easy it is saying, "All right, I bet you whatever you want, Floyd win." And people just give you their money. You know how long I've been making money. Nah, but who have you fought? Everybody. He's he fought, fought more world, world champions, champions than Muhammad Ali. Are you crazy? Google no, it. He did. He did. Google, Google it. He did. Google it. Pull it up. He's fought more world no, champions than what anybody they in the sport of boxing. Statistically, paper champions. Everybody <laughs> champions on paper. The no, WBC, no, no, no. I mean, the WBA, they all got a right on them. But no, no, I like I like Ali though. You like? I Ali. love Ali. I like Ali though. We I love like Ali here at the Manny Man don't, don't Podcast. Get me wrong. We love Ali. We love him. <laughs> don't get me wrong. If I'm y'all, not, if you can't go with Jack Johnson, it's gonna be Muhammad Ali. Ali. I mean, Jack Johnson. If you ask my Muhammad Ali, the reason why I got that because I got it from Muhammad Ali. He whatever he went through, Jack Johnson went through way more. They was fighting in Cuba. You know how many rounds they was fighting? Fifteen. They wasn't fighting no fifteen rounds. Twenty seven. Yeah, thirty. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yeah, well, you got me on that one. I want to see that you one. Got me on that YouTube one. a thirty round fight. Yeah, I gotta got see me that. on that one. I got I see, thirty I look, rounds. I'm gonna have to look that one up. <laughs> look it up. No thirty. Oh That's yeah. Good. Oh, That's like this. Bare knuckle. Mm-hmm. With just cloth around. Yes. That's it. Well, that's before my time. Well, I wasn't there. <laughs> I'm talking about as far as my knowledge. But my history books show me. <laughs> so, I'm not going to be the one to argue with you on that point. See? I'm going to let him do that. He, he, hey, he we can go all day. I ain't wrong. Floyd wrong. the best they ever put gloves on to me. But of to course. Me, to me. To me. me. I ain't we speaking in Vegas. for the world. No. I could be in <laughs> South Africa. <laughs> No, well, and they, they definitely going to be like, you are talking about who? <laughs> <laughs> I could be in South Africa. There's monuments say. of there's no. monuments no. of Muhammad no. Ali. <laughs> he said there he, is. He said he got y'all on the payroll. <laughs> yeah, he did. Yeah, he did. Oh, so disrespectful. So All the disrespectful. Way, <laughs> but I mean, I mean, I mean, you got to give it to who you got to give it to. Listen to me. I love Floyd. All his little pizzazz and all that and rules. I love all that. It's fun. Okay? But when it comes to the greatest. But now that you say that, though, now that you think, uh, since you called Pacquiao to beat Thurman, what you think happened on the Floyd Pacquiao part two? Since Floyd already, Pacquiao was fighting the same on Keith Thurman as he did against Floyd a couple years ago. So I don't see no difference. I see Floyd beating the man's down. But since you like Pacquiao to I'm gonna say you like Pacquiao to be Floyd. Um, if they did it again, who you like? I don't know. Pac, listen, I was surprised Floyd won that fight. Why was you? Everybody knew but you. Right. No, not everybody. Why was you surprised? Not everybody. Yeah, why was you surprised? That's because they, they don't put know on boxing. a boxing list and don't do. They don't know boxing. You know how many times boxing has been wrong? Floyd ain't never been wrong in the ring. He's smart. It's here. He's smart. Not here. Not here. For Not somebody here. who can't read, he's smart. 
That boy is live off the hook. Yeah. At the main event podcast, like and subscribe on YouTube. It goes down here. We bring you the real all the time. Everybody follow us. Yeah, I mean, the man is a smart businessman. And he the best in the ring, hands down. So you say Floyd B. Pacquiao, part two. He beat him? I don't know. Because we got a couple more fights to talk to. We can go on and on about Floyd. His resume is impeccable. I think I think so. I don't know. Floyd, yes, said same thing with Pacquiao. He represents something else. Pacquiao? Yeah. Okay. It didn't help him when they fought. <laughs> and that whole country, everybody that bought tickets and didn't thousand, help. ten, twenty, thirty thousand dollars. That came dollar all tickets, the way over here. Filipino flags. That shit did not help. Excuse my language. Yeah. It didn't it didn't help. Right. And it won't help again. Okay. Okay. It helped him when he fought Thurman, or Thurman wasn't ready. I mean, you got me for my dinner, so I mean that is what it is. But we are gonna be even <sighs> after they. Thurman, fight. How, 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 old Thurman? Way. how old is Thurman? I don't even think he's thirty yet. Right. How old is how, how old is Pacquiao? Pacquiao, Pacquiao, Pacquiao up, up there, up there, and he still got that ass whooped. He did. No, nah, he did. But he can't whoop Floyd. I don't think Pacquiao whooping Floyd either. Honest. I don't know. I really. I he really couldn't whoop him when they fought. And he couldn't whoop him five years ago when they said that he was running from Pacquiao. Have you ever seen, um, I just said his name, Fight Sugar Ray? Sugar Ray Robinson or Sugar Ray Leonard? Leonard. Which one? Leonard, yeah. yeah we, uh, his daddy and no, Sugar no, Ray no, Leonard? No, 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 no. What's, what's, I just said, uh, no mas, no mas. Oh, Roberto Robert Durant. Durant. Robert Durant. Durant. Robert Durant. Roberto Durant. Durant. I'm yeah. sorry. Yeah. You're too young to know about that. I see Man, are you? Fight. No mas? Yeah. I seen that fight. I mean, it was a dog fight. The rematch when he said no mas, he had, they gave him like what thirty days to lose seventy five pounds or something like yeah, that. Yeah, he yeah. tried to lose seventy five pounds yeah. at thirty. That's why he said no mas. He yeah. was through. Yeah, he, was, he did it for the bread. He needed money. Yeah, man, a couple million dollars make you do anything. But well, remember, he came in as an underground. Roberto Duran. Yeah, hey, but he worked his way to the top, man. He had a whole country behind him. You know why? Because it's here. <laughs> He represents something more. <laughs> right. It just didn't help Pacquiao when he fought Floyd. <laughs> right. Right. Okay. We, yeah, we you guys said that one time. We get that. We get that. Every, <laughs> we get that. every, we get it. every person has a has a time. Right. When Mike went down, people shitted. Oh, sorry. People vomited in their mouth. <laughs> <laughs> they was like, "How is the church boy beating up Mike Tyson?" Mike was so frustrated, he bit his ear. Holyfield. Yeah. There's no way I can win, but I'm going to foul myself out. But tell him, Mike, to, mm-hmm. to, to, to Mike's Tyson's yeah, well, discretion. Okay, yeah, what? Now yeah, what? He had a very good if, reason for biting him, though. I agree. What? He kept head buttoning. That's all part of boxing. He kept, no, listen, no, no listen, head buttoning listen, is not part listen, of boxing. Listen. Man, man, that's going to happen. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait a minute. Thank you. I got to disagree with you. Thank you. Because. That ain't no reason to bite nobody. That's right. That ain't no reason to bite nobody. He turned to him. I, I, I like I, I was never, riding with you. Look, listen. <laughs> I, I, no, no, no. I like Mike. But no, no, let's be honest though. Let's be let's put it where yeah. it is. That ain't no reason no. to bite nobody. If you're getting head butted, then you do what you gotta do to knock him out. The head button is done. It's a fight. It is a fight. And you know biting ears is illegal in boxing, right? <laughs> yeah, it is illegal So you telling boxing. me it's okay to be illegal because he's no, whooping you. No, I'm saying it's okay because I watched Holyfield headbutt Mike Tyson purposely Everybody 75,000 times. No, Everybody. Not like How Holyfield. How many times you been headbutt? That was Man, his I third love. fist. His headbutt was his third fist. And How a lot of fights. many times do you Since get Since we headbutt. talking about Haseen Rockman, did you see Holyfield fight Haseen Rockman when he headbutted him all fight? Haseen Rockman had a bowling ball on his head yeah. from the headbutts all night. How do we know that was from the headbutts and not them fists? Because I watched the fight. I seen the headbutts You see Holyfield night. hit But Holy, Holyfield, <laughs> listen, Holyfield is known. He's known for headbutting. That's his so third So somewhere fist. down in your training camp, Whoever training you got to prepare you for the headbutt that's coming. Yeah. But you know every trainer you ain't on their game. Bro. You can't get in the ring and make excuses. Yes. You're right. You can't do that. In mm-hmm. boxing, either you're going to win or you're going to lose. You're right. Bottom line. You're right. No excuses. Mike should have been a coach. 
No, it's, it's just Mike, the way that's, it. why, that's why he's it's, here it's at the, the bottom main event. That's you know, why I'm not, he's here. Man, I like I love Mike Tyson. I almost cried when Buster Douglas knocked him out. I was hurt too. But the but hurt. the truth is when the truth. Holyfield did it. Mike was People not was prepared mad. for those fights. No. He just wasn't prepared. That's what I'm trying to tell you. What? Floyd is smart. He the smartest in the that, game. That day is around the corner. No, 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 no. It's not called dancing. No, no, no. Let's put it with it. It's called boxing. The reason, the, one of the reasons why Thank you. We, we can stand behind Floyd as the greatest mm -hmm. is because he's smart. smart. Bottom line, when, when you can not only get the most money, you said fighting for something greater, right? Look at his fights from De La Hoya. Right, mm -hmm. and everybody he fought after that up until Conor represented McGregor. something bigger. Right? Why? Because they are the ones that brings the money. Mm -hmm. What's his why, middle name? Baby? Why should he fight somebody around the corner for four or five million dollars when he can fight somebody with a country behind him that's going to give him thirty-five, fifty million dollars behind him? Right. So yeah. all this about Floyd ducking and dodging and running? No, 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 no. It's about money. You don't fight. I'm not saying ducking and dodging. I'm what saying, you saying? What's around that corner? He know. <laughs> what's, what's, what's around what's the corner? What's around the corner? What's around the corner? Ass whooping is around the corner. Well, how long have he had? How long did he have the titles? Who? For how long Floyd been a champion? For almost twenty years. He Since never I lost a belt. So, he just gave so him he been a, he been around a lot of he, corners. He did what? He never he never lost the belts. He's he been around a lot yeah, of won another one. And if and if what's that dude from um, Nebraska? Uh, Terrence Bud. Crawford. Bud. I think he got that. He, 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 Bud is the truth. He, no, he, no, Bud he, is good. He, he, you was you brought up Bud in the barbershop. Bud is your boy. No, I, listen, I never met him. No, no, no. I'm saying just boxing wise, you think that boy is something vicious? Listen, I've been in Nebraska. I've seen people fighting in the Quick Trip. <laughs> <laughs> And he is the truth. Him and him and Floyd ever got it. Uh -oh. You would see some. I would have to. I, uh, no. I don't know. No, because I still will have Floyd. The I main, I'm, I'm, I'm going to tell, tell you the main. I'm going to tell you the main reason why I would still have Floyd. If you dissect his fights, yeah. By the time he get to the fourth or the fifth round, he didn't already figured his fighter out from top to bottom. He didn't already made adjustments. And from that round on, he's going to work. He gonna know what's I, gonna happen in the night. I haven't round. now. Now, don't get me wrong. Bud is, Bud is. He has that pizzazz. He can do the same thing. But you think I have not seen <laughs> Bud do it on the level that Floyd has done it on? He, they won't let him go. I to have that not level. seen him do it like they, that. They're not gonna let but him go to that level. When like, I seen like him go fought, up to forty-seven, when, he when ain't he, really looked that. When hot. he fought Gamboa, he switched from soft paw to orthodox. <laughs> So he have it in him. It's not like it's not there. And he tore, I mean, Gamboa was the hottest name out at the time. And he put gloves on Gamboa like it was a spar match. Put paws on him. That so, is true. So we're not, I'm not taking nothing from Bud. Bud is lit. But I don't think Bud smarts in the ring is superior to Floyd. But we know that fight ain't going to never happen. But what if Bud and Earl Spence fight? Now, that's a fight that. Come on, man. Potentially, what you mean? Come on, who is it hands down to? We we overlooking Bud. Cleveland right now. That's know, that's why man. he mad. Said, <laughs> is that what it is? We no. overlooking Cleveland no. right now. That's Come why he on, mad. man. <laughs> first of all, <laughs> he got to make it flash. Cleveland. First of all, it, 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 it's Cleveland. Do what he got to do. It's um, where where um, um LeBron from? Um, Akron. Akron. No, Akron. It's Akron. Same thing. <laughs> 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 so you riding with Bud, hands down over Earl. I want to know why. What has Bud showed you that Earl hasn't showed you? He's a killer. <laughs> I mean, what is Earl? I mean, Earl is a killer too. He got mm, knockouts on his resume. Not he busting eye sockets out. Bud is so smooth and quiet with it. And he's like, listen here, I got you. He reminds me of uh, the, the the 70s fighters. You know, he reminds me of Sonny Liston. Bud. In what way? He's just quiet. Okay. He is a quiet individual. He is nice, though. But he really ain't going to sell a fight. He sell it with his fist. Yeah, okay. What time? What time? <laughs> <laughs> 
He'll be there. Yeah, it, it, it'll be, it'll be a check. real good He'll matchup. Show up and show out. Yes, it's going to be a real dinner, good matchup. Another, another it's dinner be a real bet. Good matchup. Another Smith? dinner bet. Another it's dinner be a bet. Good matchup. Yes. <laughs> With Spence and Bud. Let's go to Disneyland on this one. All right. Uh, would be, <laughs> that would be, I'm that, would be dinner bet. that would be Two the fight. Hold on, hold on, hold on. A <laughs> dinner bet and a Disneyland. <laughs> hey, we got to do what we got to do here at the main event podcast. Don't, like don't, and subscribe don't, don't, all the time. Like and subscribe I all want, the time. I want pictures of me on one of the rides going, wee. <laughs> 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 Whoa. <Hey. laughs> But <laughs> hey, but since we run it down the list of fighters, right? Let me uh let me ask you, what's your take, your full take? Because I know you you a big fan of the sport. That's why we brought you here to the main event podcast. Like and subscribe. What is your take on A B as beaten <laughs> another? You know, he got a whole bunch of names, but what is your take on A B clean as possible? Remind you, he's from Ohio. Damn. He from Cincinnati. <laughs> All right, I oh, you mean said A.B. Um, Floyd's um, apprentice? If that's what you want to <laughs> yeah. call him. If that's what you want to. I just want to know your take. Because he fought Pacquiao, too. Yeah. What he happened? did. What happened? You he tell won. me what happened. I paid for that fight. You he tell won. me what happened. <laughs> <laughs> he won. <laughs> I paid to watch that fight. You tell me what he happened. He won. Right. Woo. Okay, hey, but prior to him losing, what did you think of him coming up? Did you think he could be the next Floyd, being undefeated, climbing the ranks like he was? I, I think he got the the gap, but see, he's not. He doesn't have the direction. If, if he, he 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 needs the direction and the work ethic, that's more. The gap is the fun part. Come on now, all that stuff is fun part. He's a street dude, but I think he was trying to prove too much that he's a street. Cincinnati ain't no place. To play at all, they sell coffins at the mall. <laughs> <laughs> you think I'm playing? <laughs> you know how they got the piano said, yeah, they do. We got somebody that been here. He know. He know. We got somebody that been here. He can co-sign. He can co-sign. You know how they? He knows. The he knows. piano store in the mall. They got coffin store. So they ain't playing. They ain't not. Playing. So I get the mentality, but he's supposed to rise above that because here's this this shot. And he's not being directed right. He, nobody's going, come here, man. That's just that's, that's how you do this. I think Floyd was doing it, and then something happened. Mm-hmm. Maybe you know, he was like. He didn't get the, all the memo. He just maybe he was like, a wait a minute. If I teach him what I know, he's going to beat me. <laughs> <laughs> That might have been it. That might have been it. No, I I, I think it's more so of a work ethic thing. Like you said, you know, if he had the work ethic. No, when he started off, he had it. Yeah, he He just got to get back to what he already knows. He did. Listen, he had the goods. He did. And what happened was he got it when he got, he met Madonna. Madonna. And, And after that, something left him because he don't let his hands go. Like he used to. If he will go back to being the A B before uh, uh, that that fight with Madonna, he was he could still be one of the top fighters today. He wouldn't be taking them losses like he's doing right now. But there's something that had to be like you said. It's not. He's got to get here. Not here. Mm-hmm. Not here. Yeah, he's. So he, if he won a couple fights and he was to get in there with Bud, what Bud gonna do to him? Come on, man. Come on, man. <laughs> Earl Spence? What Earl Spence going to do to him? That might be a draw. <laughs> <laughs> you just don't. You just don't think Earl can win a fight, huh? When I ride with somebody, I ride. ride. Seat okay. belt and everything. Hey, Ain't no getting out. We the sparring car. today. With Strap. <laughs> <laughs> Strap up. You ride. What did Earl say about it? His boy Porter. Hey, I, hey, I see. He would look, sell out a family barbecue. <laughs> a Sunday that is dinner. where Earl, a, a, a Sunday, Sunday dinner. dinner. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm now, sorry. Now, when has Earl Spence sold out anything? By the way, when him and Mikey Garcia fought at Cowboys, Cowboys Stadium. Cowboys, Stadium. Cowboys yes, Stadium. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Pay per view. Yep. Pay per view. I fought on yes, that card. Yes, sir. He fought on that under card. Yep. He can co-sign. He sold it out. He got tickets for free. No, I show you a video. <laughs> <laughs> He fought on the under it was card. He could <laughs> Those tickets were cheap, though. Nah. Nah. 50,000 seats, you can make them cheap on the business. I know. Man. So don't say. Sold out is sold out. Sold out is sold out. $20 or $10,000. On paper, is sold out. That's what we talking about, right? Listen to me, though. On paper. It's proof 
How many Sunday dinners he sold out? It's, I'll wait. It's <laughs> 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 you shoot yeah, shots, I'm shooting them back. Hey, <laughs> it's right. proof that the people in Dallas just love going to the Dallas Stadium. It is proof. That's they just true. love going there no matter yeah. who's there. They didn't even know if they was a fight there. I mean, to their credit. They've been going there and they ain't won no championship. Why are you trying to downplay my man? I'm, I'm not <laughs> but you do got a point. Thank you. Mike, they, they Dallas sell people that place love that, out right, all look, the time. I mean, it is a really nice thing. It can be a picnic. <laughs> and they going to sell it out. They sold out picnic. for the picnic. <laughs> I, got, I got one for them. Come on. Sean can sell out a Sunday dinner there. Let me tell you something. <laughs> I think Sean's next fight should be at Mad Square Garden. Shut everybody up. After, after you got to get past Earl first, and they might talk about it. Listen to me. Earl is going to be, and quote me. Okay. We quoting him here at the main event. Go ahead. Light work. Dinner for free. Light work. That sounds like dinner for free. That does. For Andy in light LA, Andy in LA too. He'll, light he'll, he'll work. He gonna try to go to Nobu. <laughs> okay. He's gonna try to go to clubs. He's gonna try to hang out with Dr. Dre. Oh, who nah, gonna nah. hang out with Dre? Spence. Nah, Spence, serious, man. That, that nah, dude, answer, he ain't look, doing all that. Me this, Can I give you a true story? Go ahead, Mike. Now, I'm sorry. Now, just on the, the Porter um, and Spence fight, it is proven mm-hmm. through the fights that Porter lost, the, the taller fighter that's able to keep him off with a jab has beaten him. Mm-hmm. The same recipe that Earl did with Mikey Garcia. Talk to him. Just a fight earlier. Talk to him. If he was to continue that same recipe. Preach. There, Porter has no chance. Amen. So what do you have to say about that? Amen. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> now these are facts. Okay. Tell it to him. Porter turns those le- losses into lessons and learn from that. That is the glass okay. is half full. Okay. That is the glass is half full. That's the truth. All right. That's the truth. <laughs> okay. So, now, are you taller than Porter? Yeah. Thank you very much. <laughs> 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 that, that was a cool one, but it didn't work on me. <laughs> it, it didn't work. It didn't work. Uh, <laughs> I call it space. Oh, he, he shot at you on that yeah, one. Yeah, he got me on that one. <laughs> That's crazy. That's why you was smart. <laughs> okay, so, you taller than him. But I want to know. He's working on his weaknesses. <laughs> but it, it didn't help him with Kel Brooks, though. Right. What happened Watch. with Kel? Kel Brooks started figuring him out. Because that's the fight jump, I was He got with that little that. jump in. Uh-huh. And when he went to jump in, Kel was catching him with that Catch right that left. stick right out here. Bam. Like, hold up. Every... Is right a twice day. a day. Okay, Kel got okay. Kel, you guys just don't understand. Well, let's the, just the pray. journey of a, of a fighter. Well, he does. Yes, yeah, it's hard. He gonna have. It's like the everyday man. If a if a dude tell me he ain't never been had his ass beat, you you, you ain't never been in no fight. You fought how many fights? I bought sixty fights. I ain't never lost. You lying. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody gonna take that L, but what you gonna learn from the L? Except, Except for, for Floyd, who? right? Hey, Mike, we be knowing, we be knowing, we be knowing. Like I Except said, for who? I had to. Like I up. said, he's smart, <laughs> and he did take an L because Ti was on him. <laughs> <laughs> Again, we, we talking about, about in the box in the ring. ring. You, you always talking about, about outside the ring. ring. Your hips go up. Talking about outside the ring. Your hips ring. go up. <laughs> <laughs> it's a fight. <laughs> T.I. was older. Oh, man. What do like, you think about that? Like black folks on that chicken. Yeah, what do you think about that? Like black on that chicken sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> I told you they didn't pay us, man. We can't bring, bring enough that damn chicken sandwich all the time. But what was you saying, Mike? I'm sorry. No, no. Give us your whole take on that Floyd and T.I. thing. What, what do you think? Social media man, went crazy. A, a yeah. woman, man. It's a bober. I mean, that's his wife. Floyd, listen. Floyd, no. He's like, he's a champ. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of unfair. Look, no T.I. Like, yo, man, that's my wife. <laughs> so, <laughs> what you want to do? You want to uh, fight? You want to fight? <laughs> He got 17,000 people behind him. <laughs> what, you want to fight? <laughs> <laughs> I 
Hey. Hey. You gotta do what you gotta do. Man. You that gotta make do. you. That make you. Uh, I mean, me. Just imagine. I mean, it's. It, I don't even want it, it, It's. No man wants to imagine coming home and Mike Tyson is tonguing your girl. Mm. <laughs> what do you do at that moment? How long are you gonna be, Mike? <laughs> <laughs> Damon Wayne said that joke all the time. How long you gonna be, Mike? How long you gonna be? Because I got to do the dishes. Because I got to do the dishes. Hey, Faze out. 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 Faze Jay-Z in the, the football thing. Speak on it. Because I was on your social media. I seen what you posted. Tell tell the people that's liking and subscribing to what we got going no, on. What do you think? I mean, I think everybody do what they got to do to get paid. But I believe he didn't speak for everybody. Don't say I, that. Listen. I'm just saying. Because at the end of the day, some people do what they got to do to get paid. You ever see a movie called Glory? Okay. I see where you're going. And all the uh, soldiers... The white soldiers got paid more than the black soldiers. And Denzel's character found out and said, well, why we, our life ain't worth, they life worth. Mm. So Denzel said, tear it up. Tear it up. <laughs> tear it up. <laughs> the one black dude said, $10, a lot of money. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you sound like just now. That's what you sound like. <laughs> I'm just asking everybody. Paid. They got to do what they got to do. I ain't judging nobody, ever. You, listen to me. The money <laughs> that you're going to make to sell your people out, there's no other race that would do that. No other race. So he was just out of line for what he did? or, or Money or? does not <laughs> equate to power. Okay? Okay. Somebody right now can give you $100 million. Are you powerful? No, I'm just rich. Not even. If somebody gave it to you, depending on the contract, I got to pay them back. Well, not even that. <laughs> when somebody just came in and just gave you $100 million, boom. Here, here's $100 million. So, so I, I got a question for you along that line. We protest and protest and protest. I don't protest. I'm just saying, you see, you know, you'll see blacks protesting. I know you'll see and, blacks and, doing a, a networking session. Okay, but... <laughs> What's the next step in your mind? You you know, tell me, you tell me what's the next step. Now, Jay-Z claimed mm -hmm. that mm -hmm. uh, the next step for him was let's get a seat at the table. Right? That's what he says. So what do you think? What do you think would be the next step? Let's, let's just do simple business. Okay. You on a barbershop. Right? Yes, sir. I'm outside the barbershop. I want to work in the barbershop. Hey, I need to get a part of this barbershop. I come in there. Are you going to give me a part of your barbershop? I just met you. You just met me, but I, I'm at the table with you. No. Ain't nobody going to give no black person no part of no football league that's been around 100 years. No, 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 but I'm asking, what is the next? We, we know. No, listen I to me. There ain't no seat at no table. So what is the next step, though? What do you mean? He's saying, how, how do we get, how do we make it okay? How do we get Man, what, it? What do we Why do? do you have to make it okay? That's what the next step no, is. No, no, no. Why do you have to make it okay? If it was up to me, I'd tell him let Cap play because he better than it ain't, it's not everybody. Even, Cap would tell you it's not about Cap. The reason why they were doing that, Black kids, black men have been shot down. Mm -hmm. Police brutality. And he right? spoke on it. No, he didn't spoke on it. He was like, I got to do something. Right. 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 So he did the kneel. Jay-Z said, all right, all right, all right. All blacks, calm down. <laughs> <laughs> We're all finished with kneeling. Let the white people do what they need to do. I'm going to get paid, and you black people are going to go to work. So he, pl he pulled the Django on us, huh? 
No, yes, the house. <laughs> yeah, house the same. The house, the house jigger. <laughs> the house jigger. <laughs> like, there's no way that you by they didn't pick somebody who knew football. Well, they thought Jay Z could get all Come the blacks on. in America. To yeah, come yeah, 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 like, like right. yeah, like a house nigga. Valid point. Why not go to somebody who knows football? Football has a lot of problems. It ain't the entertainment that's killing it. The collective bargain agreement. You know why Zeke is not playing right now? Tell us. Every day he doesn't play. What? He has to play another year. For every day he don't play? Every When he doesn't check in, he has to play another year. He's under contract. Well, I didn't know why he started tripping on his contract anyway. He was still in his rookie contract. Right. When you in that contract, you can't bang for another contract till that's up. Well, some well, some people do when you Yeah, they do that. They right. do that for certain players. Mm-hmm. Absolutely. And that's what I'm saying. That's what's wrong with part of it, the collecting bargain agreement. But see nobody talking about that. They talking about halftime dancing. Well, they are trying to get more viewers on the Super Bowl uh, halftime show. That that's that that that's what I'm trying to that's what I'm trying to tell you. That's that's a moot mo- point. <laughs> I mean, well, so, you know, that's I mean, why but, they did it. But I'm the, I'm 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 following you, but at the same time, so do we stop kneeling? What do we do? What Listen do we do? Me. How are you? I'm 46. Okay. We've been fighting police since I was 16. Mm-hmm. Okay, you want to go to jail? You want to go home? That's right. Okay. Rodney King happened in '92. I was part of that whole riot. Mm-hmm. How many TVs you get? I got me some. Uh, I got me a <laughs> CD. <laughs> some speakers. I got the CD when they was dead bad. Oh, oh, oh the real big was heavy. the size of albums. Right. They was like, <laughs> help me with this. Okay. So where, so where, 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 where is, where, where has anything got better? That's what I'm at. That's, that's my point. Yeah. How do you take that next yeah. step? That's what that's he's my saying. Whole, How do you take that next point. step? Ka- Kalanick, Cap. Kaepernick reminded you, this ain't over. It'll never be over. That's what I'm trying to tell you. To answer I'm, your point. If it's never going to be over, uh-huh. you tell me in your words, uh-huh. what's the next move? Somebody gave yeah, you all the money in the world. Move. How do you fix it? Somebody so, gave so, so, you so, so, $10 billion. It's not about dollars. money. How do we you keep fix it? Tell you, it's not about money. I'm going to tell you, Tupac said it. It's about power and money. And then we heard Hail Mary. You know. You know we heard. Don't go. <laughs> don't say the rest. Nah, nah. Don't say the rest. <laughs> he was my, I know the intro. I know the intro. I'm going to play it in the car now that you said that. That's I, what it's about. It is. It is at the end of the day for sure. I agree one hundred percent. But he at, at some point, how do we get over it? I mean, we do at some point. It got to be at some point. point. I mean, now, look, now here's a bar right. Are here. we gonna keep doing this, complaining here's, about it? Exactly. I don't, I don't That's look, exactly. What I don't I'm complain. Keep bringing how it up. How do we get? Keep how do we get past? You know, I don't. I, I hear your argument. You hear my argument. We arguing. There's no we argument. Together, I'm just. Just let me finish. And we sitting together complaining about what's being done to us. We this is happening. That happened. Police is killing our kids, and they doing that. And, what do we do to solve it? Call Jay Z. Call Jay Z. And they did, but that was they the call, wrong move, I guess. How Who was they? So, they if, was if supposed to call us. If Jay Z the wrong move, what's the? How right is he move? the right move? I'm, I'm asking. How is you, he the right move in your mind? I never said he was. I'm trying to get out of but, you. But I'm saying, but why does that make sense? Because he can rap. That ain't. I never said he was the right move. <laughs> but I'm saying, what makes him the right move? Out of everybody to call. Mm-hmm. The rapper, the guy that lied about selling dope. I feel who, you. Who would you prefer but, but, they but call? Who is that's better for the job? A football player, okay. Kaepernick. Well, they had already broke bread with Cap. It don't matter. Disclosed. They wasn't gonna not, bring it back. But up there's no other way. people Cap that got his money already. He's he ain't kneeling no more. If, would y'all mind if I ran the boxing committee? Woo! I'd have to interview you. Uh, yeah. Why you didn't interview Jay Z then? We got to ask Commissioner uh, Thank Goodell. you very much. We got to ask Commissioner Goodell. Thank you very Yeah, thank you very much. <laughs> thank you very much. Well, you want somebody who don't really know? Remember, so you so your, whole, your whole point is you just hired the wrong guy. That's it. That's what you're saying. On purpose. 
We get that. I, I get that. Oh, I, I get purpose. what you're saying. He's not there because he knows football. He's there because he's a distraction of what's really going down. Like, please watch football again. Because I didn't know that many people stopped watching football. A no, lot I, of people I did. Say, yeah. A lot of people yeah. did stop watching. Yeah. yeah. So, Kaepernick probably yeah. really, no. really did something. No, he did. No, he did. He, he, he now really, that's being overshadowed by, let's just get past it. When you black guys, come on. I know some few black people died. <laughs> but but he but, still but said, but how I'm, do we fix it? I'm just if saying, the power in your hand, how do you why, fix the what, issue? What, what, what issue? Are you talking about fix what? Football? What Cap was kneeling oh. for and why they brought Listen, Jay-Z in like, to, like to you put a before. Band-Aid on it. It's, 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 it has nothing to do with football and entertainment. It has nothing to do with the police brutality. Right. So that's the focus, not football. Right. And, and that being the focus... We haven't got past protesting. What do we do now? What do you mean? Jay-Z said we, we, we're past it. I, I'm not thinking about Jay-Z. But he said we're we past, past it. past Jay-Z. I'm talking about the real issue of why Kavanick was on his knees. What do we do? Because it's continuing to happen. Our black kids are still getting shot. We're still not getting a fair shot. So what do we do? We protest and protest and protest. No, we don't. Yes, we do. There was only one protest. What was that? 92. <laughs> you was in Los Angeles 92. You knew so, what the protest was. So, and you, you know something? So, ha- you know so, something? Can I say something? Ain't nothing weird went down in L.A. since 92. So your point is. Huh? Huh? Ain't nothing weird went down in 92. So, so to solve that, so we need a worldwide, well, nationwide L.A. 92. That's what we need? It's been the main event. <laughs> it's been the main <laughs> event podcast. Like and subscribe. You know, we had a great time with the homie Faison. He likes Sean Porter. He don't like they gave Jay-Z the keys to the NFL. He loves Cleveland. And he loves Cleveland. <laughs> I do love Cleveland. <laughs> and he loves Cleveland. Ohio is, yeah, you know. Hey. Cleveland. Hey, where, man. where you from? I'm from Wisconsin. Oh, you know what's so funny? I was going to move to Wisconsin. Wisconsin's dope. Too cold. Too cold. That's why I'm in Vegas. It's too cold. That's why I'm in Vegas. And the Packers are there. I'm well, a Chiefs know, fan. They're there, but you know. I ain't nobody worried about the nah, Packers. Nah, they all the way in Green Bay. They got some women in Wisconsin. I ain't never been there. What? My woman's right there. I, I know. I, yeah. She finna break <laughs> your neck. <laughs> I, never, I, never, I never been there. My woman's right there. She was like, her neck was like, ugh. <laughs> <laughs> it's possible. It's, it's, it's just like Compton. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> But on that note, man, you know we've been here for a minute, man. The main event podcast. Like and subscribe. To my right, I got Thomas Hill, the active fighter. To my other, other left is Mike Risper, been my partner for a long time. We long always time. breaking it down in the sport of boxing. And they wrong about Jack Johnson. And I'm out. It pays our love, everybody. We appreciate the homie coming through, blessing hey, us and everything. But I am. I'm going to go and um, get educated on Jack Johnson. Thank you. I Everybody, thank you. If you're- Jack Johnson was the man. I've done the education. I just personally believe. And I'm going to try to become a fan of Cleveland just for a little bit. Trust just, me. Just a little bit. Trust they me. ain't got Trust LeBron me. no more, so I ain't a fan. Well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I knew he was going to go to the Lakers. But yeah, that makes sense. Everybody he don't he even was like Cleveland, the Lakers, man. man. Cleveland, no. <laughs> you feel you, me? You ain't heard of OJs? OJ. The OJs. Yeah. Don't get me started. The OJ. Oh, the singing group. Yeah, the yeah. singer. I thought you was talking about the big homie. Oh. <laughs> My bad. I just say, don't get me you started. Like, you don't like OJ? OJ, look, that's a whole nother podcast, y'all. We ain't even going to do this right now. My wife would say, I'll go hard for OJ. That's my podcast. <laughs> too. Okay. Well, we might need to talk, and then we can come back and talk. And, and my two dinners, you know. And the make two sure, dinners. Yeah, make sure that happens. Well, I'm going to break plus, even plus with him. I'm going to break even with him. I can't wait till this fight happens. I'm going to be there. When this fight happens, I'm going to walk up to you and you see. I'm going to be so full. I'm gonna be eat like I got two assholes. <laughs> you gotta let them both go, and at that point, ladies and gentlemen, we gonna sign off the main event podcast. Like no and cousin. subscribe. We all here. Thank you for tuning in, ladies and gentlemen. Until next week. You should call this podcast um, Floyd Pay Me. <laughs> <laughs>